Hello, I'm Brigadier General Joe Girard, Commander of the Georgia Army National Guard. I'm here with Chaplain Blair Davis, the Operations Chaplain for the Army National Guard. We are here today to talk about suicide and how we can save soldiers' lives. The Army National Guard lost 392 lives to suicide from 2007 to 2011, six of which were from Georgia. So the threat is there and it is real. We need to be vigilant because one suicide is too many. Today's Guardsmen are under more stress than ever and need our help. Some are dealing with personal or professional disappointments. Others are returning from months of combat service to a home that has changed in a tough job market. These and many other stressors can affect our soldiers and send the best of us into a downward spiral of depression. The National Guard has lost too many soldiers to suicide. We have to get our soldiers help before it is too late. This begins with leader and peer involvement. Don't be afraid to ask a soldier if he or she is depressed or thinking of suicide. Care for them and let them know that depression is temporary and treatable. Then escort them to help. I am telling you that it is okay for our soldiers to seek help. We have a lot of programs and services designed to help soldiers deal with these challenges life throws at them. Let the professionals work for you and help you when you need it most. Your first point of contact should be your chaplain. That's right, sir. Be vigilant not only while deployed, but also here at home. Watch your battle buddy and assess yourself while looking for the warning signs of suicide and depression. Statistics show that 50 to 75 percent of those considering suicide will give someone, a friend, or a relative a warning sign. They may even tell you they are thinking about suicide in a joke or in a side comment. All cries for help must be taken seriously. However, not everyone who is considering suicide will say so. Soldiers at risk for suicide generally have experienced a major life crisis, such as the death of a loved one, a breakup of a relationship, a major illness diagnosed, or experiencing a serious financial problem. These events are overwhelming and should not be taken on alone. We have resources available to help you cope with the stresses caused by these events. So help your battle buddy reach out for help. Or if you're going through a major life crisis, please call. Please call me at 404-272-4775. Or if you want to contact someone outside of the Georgia Army National Guard, please contact the Confidential Veterans Affairs Crisis Line at 1-800-273-8255, extension 1. Please call. Your battle buddy, chain of command, and I want to help you. Remember, depression is temporary and treatable. Please call. If you find yourself choosing to be alone, avoiding friends and social activities, if you are drinking too much, especially if alone, if you are experiencing relationship challenges or other emotional challenges, please call. Don't wait for help. Call now. Call your battle buddy, call your platoon sergeant, or call your chaplain, but just call. You are a volunteer citizen soldier, a patriot, a hero. We need you and want to help. The Georgia Army National Guard has the programs and professionals to help you through this temporary and treatable period of depression. Don't go through it alone. You know we are a part of a proud organization that fights for our country, but we also fight for each other. So thank you for serving and keeping this great country of ours free and our families safe. I am proud to stand and serve with you and want to continue to do so. So together, let's help our fellow soldiers.